I took the plunge and basically I've been and bought from DD Amex the DD Whoopi Slings. So now what I'm going to do is uh, fit them in to my DD Amex. This is, anybody wants to know, it's the Northern Ireland Patrol Pack. So, probably get rid of them now. We study at we study pants, trousers, the hammock, okay, my tarp. Sorry, that's my tarp, and that's my hammock. So, with a bit of luck. get rid of this I'm doing these now so I'm just threading it through probably take a bit of time to do it but threading it through I think what's made it easy is because he had them straps coming through originally. So, and this is not using a bar like they tell you to do, just threading it through by hand. And then, That's one end through. So, pull it together. So let's go through that bit. And that's that. And that's one end. Just coming to the last bit now, on the second part of it. There you go, that's all through. Put that through the loop. Gather it together. And that's that. I've got three hookers. Two tree huggers. And now what I'm going to do is just put these around my artificial tree. And some people say there wasn't a good length in the straps. How big do you want your tree? So anyway, make sure they're equal. This is just for demonstration only. Should I go around twice on this? Now, put a whoopie sling in, whoopie sling, tighten it up, all I do, this little bit which is hanging out here, is pull.
But what I've done is, I mean, this is this isn't idea of this post, to be honest. It's not steady. It's just for demonstration. So I've put this round here. Put my three uggers on. This is to basically adjust it up and down. So we can show you. We can pull that here. And then basically, if I want to, I loosen it. From here. So, pull one of these, one with the bobble on, and then tighten it from that one. If you have a look at it, you can see it goes inside it. That's the one with the bobble on, is the one that you pull to slacken it off, and this one is to tighten it up as such. We have quite a lot of excess here. The whoopee sling. Like I said, the one with the bubble on is the one that loosens it. And this one pulls it, tightens it. So the one with that on loosens and this one tightens it up. Run back down it it seals it and same with this one seals it back locks it it's like a chinese grip i'm not i'm not going to sit in it because the poles aren't very strong on here to be honest see <coughs> well there today i am going to put some bigger poles in posts and uh, get a better way of doing it so we can have it in the garden that's the new clips what they've got DMM so all those on YouTube who have been watching um, thank you, because I was very, very sceptical about buying them. Didn't want to buy them. I didn't think I could trust them. I still don't know yet, because I've not sat in it. But I've seen some big fellas sat in them. But when you think about sitting on this, lying in it, on just a thin piece of cord, it doesn't bear thinking about, does it? but I'll be trying that tomorrow in the woods so should I put the tarp up and see what that's like yeah I'll go. right so now I've just put it up only temporary not a proper fix but you can see and this is the 3b3 tarp this um all the tabs on so having it like that you can see we've got quite a lot of room underneath it like i said i've only tied it off from my fence and tied it off from a thing on the shed a screw on the shed but it has got a little bit of a dip here because i haven't got long enough cord on so, that, I'm quite happy with. It's bigger than what I thought, this uh, tap. What I can remember that it was, anyway. Usually, like, the way I have it, I have it um, angled like uh, an A-frame. So, it's basically an A-frame on each side. Now, on the Multicam one I've got, that's a lot bigger. I think that's four and a half by... For now. I can't remember exactly what that is, but that's a lot bigger that one and basically that becomes like a tent So it's like an a-frame and I've got doors on it then adjust it that way, but I am happy with these uh, 
whoopee slings. I'm impressed. So, for all those who's basically pushed me into getting them, I think I'm glad you have. Compared to, I mean, this is quite light. And that, how quick you can set it up with that is brilliant. I mean, the other system, like I said on my previous video, I did a little modification so it can easily hang it up quicker, and it does work, but it's the weight. If you can minimise the weight of things, it makes it a lot easier. On your back, I'll just show you on top. And underneath. So I think, honestly think now, I'm going to get some stronger posts in the garden for summertime. And then at least I can chill out in it. Because they're not strong enough. They're really, really not. And I mean, I was going to put a beam from this side over to the other side and strengthen it that way. Still might do, try it. But yeah, that's how we go for now. So... Please hit the subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and I'll see you all soon on the next one, when I'm out in it probably. Bye for now.